Helene has strengthened into a hurricane with forecasters warning that the storm would intensify as it crosses the Gulf of Mexico on a path to Florida. The storm has already prompted residents to evacuate, schools to close and officials to declare emergencies in Florida and Georgia. The U.S. National Hurricane Center said the hurricane was about 430 miles southwest of Tampa, Florida, and had sustained winds of 85 miles per hour. In Tampa, strong waves and currents surged in around twilight on Thursday. Meanwhile, streets in Sarasota County have been flooded. Fast-moving Hurricane Helene is advancing across the Gulf of Mexico toward Florida, and it has been upgraded to a Category 2 storm. Western Cuba endured the slow passage of Hurricane Helene from Wednesday evening until Thursday. Families had to be evacuated in boats as water covered the streets and invaded homes. Authorities said Thursday that electricity services were severely affected as the storm moved away. In the province of Artemisa, about 160,000 out of 200,000 customers have been without electricity since Wednesday night. In the nearby province of Pinar del Rio, another 70,000 customers were reported without electricity. Local media said around 800 people living in flooded areas had to be evacuated. At Isla de la Juventud in the Caribbean Sea, the main dam had to be relieved of water to avoid overflowing. Havana experienced an uptick of wind and rain overnight without any damage. Helene is the eighth named storm of the Atlantic hurricane season, which began June 1.